All right, you guys, we're going to be paying attention to the guy that just walked in the door, not the guy in the green. That's Richard. He's cool. He likes to pay for stuff. I'm talking about the guy in the red right here. He's going to come over here, and instantly the hostess is going to catch his eye. He's looking at him. He's thinking, yeah, definitely going to grab one of those later. So he turns around, and he's going to grab a medium coffee cup. He's going to come back to the coffee counter, and he's going to grab the sugar. He needs to sweeten up that coffee, so he's going to sprinkle some into his cup, and he's going to turn back around, look at the coffee. Yeah, I want the regular. I want the regular. So he's going to put a nice big square of French vanilla in there. He's going to turn back around and he's going to get that coffee. So he fills her up and he's going to quick look over the counter right there. Yeah, I got to make sure the cashier is not paying attention to you. Now, he's got to stir that coffee. So he's going to reach in there and he's going to grab two stir sticks. Obviously, you can't stir it with one. You need to waste two. So he's going to start opening those up while he looks at the hostess section trying to figure out what he wants. Maybe he wants some donuts. Maybe he wants some Twinkies. Maybe some Ho-Hos. We don't know. So he's going to keep opening up those stir sticks. He finally got them. He's going to leave the trash on the counter for the next person. And he's going to grab some zingers and set them down on the counter. Uh, yes. Stir that coffee. You know what? I should probably try this. Ooh, yeah. Nice and hot. Just how I like it. Ooh, what do we got here? Looks like the cashier's busy. Just what I've been waiting for. So he's going to reach into his left pocket, make sure it's nice and empty. It is. He's going to reach into his right pocket. Nope, that one's too full. So he's going to grab those zingers and he's going to try sliding those into his pocket. Uh oh, he's having a problem. Yep, he's got to lift up that shirt and shoop, boop, slides them right into his pocket. And he's finally going to put that lid onto his coffee. Now, why would you conceal the merchandise that you plan on paying for, especially when you're going straight? up to the counter that doesn't make any sense so he's got his coffee and his wallet he's going to put the wallet in his right hand because he's got to use his left hand to go into the pocket with the zingers so he's feeling those zingers he's got to pull out the only form of payment he has which is a handful of change so he gets it out and he comes up to the counter Oh man, he must have forgot about those. Oh, can't use the change now because that ain't going to pay for a thing of hostess and a coffee. So he's going to pull out a credit or debit card that he knows is going to get declined so that he doesn't actually have to pay for those zingers that he tried stealing. Hey, you doing? I get you. So he inserts the card and instantly starts counting out the change again because he knows that card's going to get declined and his only form of payment is change. Declined! Uh, now he only wants the coffee, how convenient. I mean, he wants the hostess, he just didn't want to pay for the hostess. Now he's holding up the line, counting his stupid change again. And she gone! 